Now let's see that handstand. Ah! Ah! Oh no. <gasps> Did you break a leg? My water broke. I think I'm having a baby. Ah! Ah! Sweetie, this what? Come on. Ah! Break this way. Lay down. I can't believe I'm having my baby in a gym. Take deep breath. Have you ever delivered a baby? No. Then not in a gym. Ah, I'm having a girl. Three, two, one, push. Ah! Okay, one more big push. Three, two, one, push. Ah! I got it. Let me just use this blanket. Is you beautiful? Baby girl. Who did it? She's gonna be a gymnast just like me. Here, I'll get her cleaned up. <laughs> Where'd she go? This is birth to death of a gymnast, but my mom gave birth to me in a gym? And your mom's coach delivered you. Oh, coach is kind of cute. What? Okay, Daniel, how do I beat this game? Well, it's birth to death of a gymnast, but it looks like it's gonna be hard to get to death. Why? I think you gotta play the game to figure that out. I'm about to go back into the metaverse, but before I do, make sure you are subscribed with notifications on if we get to 13 million by the end of the year. We're having a huge Zoom party. Hopefully we get it, but Daniel, get me back in. Go. Comment 13 million below if you subscribed. I really want that Zoom party. Okay, Rebecca, mommy's here. She wants to do a little bit of gymnastics. Do you want to do gymnastics, Rebecca? Look, she runs on the boat as fast as she can. She puts her hands up. She does two flips and then, ta-da, she sticks the landing. Good job, Rebecca. Oh, her mom's teaching her gymnastics. Oh, Rebecca's the little baby. Baby looks familiar, though. It's the metaverse, Matt. Everyone looks familiar. One day, you're going to win the National Gymnastics Championships. Look, you're already doing the salute. Rebecca, I hope you love gymnastics as much as I do. You were born to be a gymnast. Mwah. Now mom's gonna do some gymnastics for you. Okay, Rebecca. Mom's gonna do a cartwheel. Handstand. And I just hold it like this all day. Look, Rebecca, your first time on a trampoline. She goes up. She does a double backflip. Just kidding. Not yet, Rebecca, but one day you'll be doing all those moves. You like it, don't you? You can't fall asleep doing gymnastics. Come here, little one. <gasps> jump, jump, jump. I love you so much. My little gymnast. Yes, Rebecca, one day you're gonna be able to do these moves too. But the handstand is the most basic and when everything else fails, just go back to the handstand. <gasps> oh, you guys, my mom, I mean, she really loves gymnastics. She wants me to be a gymnast too. You started really early. Did you see me jumping on that trampoline? Oh yeah, that's actually your mom jumping. Okay, but I was in her arms. Anyways, I think this birth to death of a gymnast is gonna be easy. Gymnastics seems so fun. I don't know where the hard part's coming in, but now you're gonna be about 10 years old? Back to the gym. Right. Put me in. There you go. Wait, sweet. Easy. Everyone work on your floor routines. Oh, that was great, Rebecca, but remember, you have to stick your landing. Otherwise, you might get a deduction this weekend, okay? Yes, Mom. But it's getting really, really good. Oh, there's your coach. Maybe we can see what she thinks. Hey, Coach Katie, how's it going? Good. Her mom's coach is now her coach. She looks pretty good. Well, Dina, just focus on the program. Sorry. That's on the coach, okay? It's that hair. I just wanted to see if you thought Rebecca was ready for this weekend. I mean, it's a big competition. The qualifying meet is important, but Rebecca has been working really hard. I'm excited for you and your husband to watch her and cheer her on. Actually, I have a really big important meeting this weekend. I don't think I'm gonna be able to make it, but her dad will be there. Mom, I need you to be there to cheer me on. I can't win without you. Honey, you have all the strength within you to do this on your own, but I am going to do my best to get there, okay? But you have to promise me you can't give up. Okay. And by the way, did you know that Coach Katie was my coach when I was your age? Yep. I even saw you get born. That is true, my water broke on the beam, and now look at you, you're about to do a qualifying competition just like me. This is so exciting. Rebecca needs to get back to work with the others. Yes, yes. Go with your friends. You have a lot of training to do. I am so nervous. When it was me, it was different, but now that it's my daughter, you really think she's ready? Yes, I think she might be as talented as you. I'm gonna do whatever I can to get to that competition. All right, everyone, let's see some kicks. Oh. Chin up, Rebecca. Mm -hmm. So good. Oh. Good. Practice makes perfect. Straight your legs, point your toes, oh. chin up. But always have fun, smile, oh yeah. Let's take this seriously, girls. Just have fun, you guys. I remember back when I was your age, I was doing straddle jumps. Get those feet up. Dance a little. No dancing. Maybe just dance a little bit. Straight legs. Just like move the hips a little. You girls look a little stiff there. Move, it's all on the hips. Excuse me. 
parents are usually not allowed. One more comment from you and you're kicked out. Are you serious? I was your gymnast. Do I look like I'm kidding? You birthed my child. Stop making things awkward. Want to do a quick shout out to everybody that got merch like these guys right here. If you want a shout out, make sure that you go to RebeccaZamolo.com and tag us on Instagram. We might shout you out in the next video. Okay, Rebecca, your straddle jump looks really good, but you've got to point those toes a little bit harder. You see how you're doing it down here? You do that on the trampoline, you're going to be ready for the meet this weekend. Wow, you're really flexible. So proud of you. Okay, now get back to the other girls. All right, girls, stand straight. Now I'm gonna have Rebecca's mom take the lead for this beam routine. Oh, she was an Olympic champion. Oh, my God. oh uh, I haven't done this in a while, but great. Now everyone knows that balance beam is not that hard, but when you have nerves at a competition, it can get very scary. So I'm just gonna have you guys stand up in fifth position, squeezing up high on those toes. Great job, bellies in. Now high V. And just remember, for this weekend, you guys have to think the same thoughts you're thinking right now. You can't let anything distract you, and you guys will all be able to qualify. Daniel, what is that right there? It looks like something bad is gonna happen in this program. We should tell her about that. No, 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 we can't tell her because she won't go back in. She's gotta complete the game. Great, we're gonna do five kicks. Ready, and one, two, three. Yes, four, get it, girls, and five. Great job, girls. It looks so bad, though. okay. So it looks like there's a qualifying competition and I'm a gymnast and as long as I qualify, we're on board to be a gymnast from birth to death. Just gotta qualify, that's the only thing I have to focus on. Do you know anything about this competition? I think it's just gonna be a little challenging. Okay, well as long as my mom's there you guys, I've got this. Okay as Daniel. As long as mom's there. So just put me in. Three, two, one. Guys, this is gonna get bad. She's gonna qualify though, right? Rebecca, this is your final event. If you can nail your floor routine, then you can qualify for nationals. But I don't see my mom. I only see my dad. This is it, honey. You've got this. I know you're gonna qualify. She's on vault, bars, and beam, and floor is her final event. Oh, and her dad is actually kind of cute. I want my mom to be here. You do not have time to focus on that. You have a chance to win nationals. Now look, the judges are saluting you. Good luck. Can't believe my meeting ran late. They knew my daughter had a gymnastics meet today. She has been training four months for this meet. I can't be the reason that she doesn't make it. I promised her. I gave her my word. I've got to get there. Up right, next, Rebecca. Where's mom? She should be here. I don't. I don't know where she's at. She'll. She'll be here though. She'll be here soon. Where is she? What's taking her mom so long to get there? She's doing her best, but I have a bad feeling about this. I'm just gonna text her dad and tell her I'm ready. Ah! No! Hello? Yes, I'm her husband. Car accident, but she's at the hospital. Okay, so she's okay. She's. She didn't... She... What? Dad? What's wrong, Dad? Rebecca, where are you going? What's wrong, Dad? I have something important to tell you, okay? Mommy was coming here and she got, she got into a car accident. She didn't make it, baby. She didn't make it. She's not coming. This is all my fault. <laughs> no, it's not your fault. I'm so sorry. This is so sad. She lost her mom. I have to pull her out. Here. Too emotional. Here we go. <sighs> I know this is really hard, Rebecca, but you gotta keep going, you gotta keep playing, because this is not the end of your journey. Why? How can I? It's so sad. Don't worry, it's gonna get better. Am I still a gymnast? Is she? Daniel, why didn't you tell her that it's not her fault? Because she needs to find that out in the program. I'm older now. Me and my mom. She loved gymnastics. This is me as a baby with my mom. She's gone now. I always thought I'd be a gymnast just like her. But now that she's gone, what do I do? Dad? Hey, Dad. Look what I made you, your favorite. Oh. Hey goes with a smiley face. Smiley face waffles. Just like your mom would make it. Well, my smile isn't as perfect as hers was. She was really good at making smiley face egos. She was. So what's the occasion, Dad? You know, your mom's birthday is coming up, and it got me thinking. You're at the age now that your mother was when she started getting really serious about gymnastics, and I was thinking that if you want to go back, it's not too late if you train really hard. Dad, I told you, I don't want to do gymnastics anymore. You were so happy doing 
doing it and you get into the national championships. I was younger then. I'm a completely different person now. Think about your mother. She loved watching you do it and you knew that was her dream for you. Yeah, and it's also the reason she's not here right now. I think it's still your dream. You can still have this dream. Dad, I don't want to win the national championships anymore, okay? That was my dream. It's not my dream now. Stop forcing it on me. I don't want any part of gymnastics, okay? Please stop pushing me. I'm out of here. Just thought I'd try. She's not doing gymnastics anymore. That was her dream. How is this supposed to be birth to death of a gymnast if there's no gymnast? That's a good point. Thank you. <laughs> I miss her so much. Why does he always try to get me to do gymnastics? That's the reason she's not here. And I miss you, Mom, so much. <laughs> Oh, I hate this. I can't see it. Oh, I hate this. What is going on? Uh, excuse me. Hey, is something wrong? Sorry, I had to see that. I'm that guy today. Well, uh, what's your name? Guy. Oh, your name is Guy? My name's Guy. That guy's name is Guy? Okay, well, that guy is pretty attractive. Nah. Oh, come on! Oh, well, I I'm Rebecca. I saw you having troubles with something. Maybe I can help? Oh, your eyes are red. What? Oh, it's just allergies. Every time I come to this bar, I just get so many allergies. Back to you. You seemed really frustrated. I mean, you threw a weight. Yeah, I don't know why I brought the weights out here to begin with, but I'm trying to learn a handstand. Oh. Yeah, I'm trying to pass parkour level two, and I said I have to do a handstand first. What is parkour? It's a mix between gymnastics and rock climbing. It's kind of like being Spider-Man in real life. Oh. I know how to do a handstand. Maybe I could help you? Here, look. I can show you. It's kind of difficult. Well, it's really not that hard once you get used to it. That's actually amazing. How did you do that? My mom taught me, actually. Let me see what you're doing. Maybe I can figure out what you're doing wrong. Just like, yep. Okay. Got it. I almost got it. Hold on. I got it. I'll show you. I'll show you. Okay. Ah, I usually do it longer than that. I can see what you're doing wrong. In a handstand, your shoulders have to go over your hands. Your shoulders are behind, so that's why you're falling. There, kick up. Try it again. Kick I'll up. I'll help you. Like just do it again. Up in the air. Yeah, just do another handstand. Here we go. Uh, okay. What? Now get your shoulders over your hands. No way. Like that. No way. She's teaching him gymnastics the same way that her mom taught her. Wow. That was good. It's the longest you did I've ever it. done before. Well, just your shoulders over your hands. Yeah. They said that before, but I didn't realize that's what they actually meant. My mom was a gymnast, and she always told me that a handstand was the best basic move that you had to learn before you could learn anything else. Oh, I wish you could coach me right now. I could really use the help. Me too. So what are you doing later? I don't really have any plans. Do you want to do some more gymnastics or catch a movie or something like that? Maybe catch a movie. That'd be good. It's a date? Yeah, I guess. She agreed to go on a date with him. We gotta pull her out. I didn't get her number. Did you see that? I'm going on a date. With a guy. But when are you gonna do gymnastics? Okay, just stop pressuring me, okay? I'm sorry, it's a lot going into the metaverse, okay? Just leave me alone. Maybe it doesn't have to be birth to death of a gymnast. Maybe there's another story in this. Yeah, that's the title, but sure, yeah. <laughs> that's probably right. Okay, Back just let me go on my date. Yeah. Stop pressuring okay, me. Okay, enjoy the movie. It's gonna be that guy, Daniel. Is this program starting to affect her in real life, not it just the metaverse? Seems like it. It's inside of her head. Put it up! Ah, don't go in there! Oh! I'm glad you're back. I mean, Whoa. not like I need you to be here or anything. A scary movie? I thought this would be like the perfect date movie. Most people are scared of them, but I'm not. Oh! Ah! That guy is such a scaredy cat. Maybe not all guys like scary movies, Maddie. You know what? I wish I was watching a scary movie with that dad. No, no, no. With that coach. Where's the coach been? Hey, just let that guy do what that guy does. I thought you weren't scared of scary movies. Yeah, uh, if you get scared, I'm right here. There's literally no armrest here at all. So, let's come on over. Okay. Great. Here we go. I don't, I don't know if I can watch this. Well, if you can't watch it, just close your eyes. Okay. Ah! Ah! I'm sorry, it's still scary. I mean, those yeah. sounds are so... I wasn't doing anything at all. Maybe watching a scary movie wasn't a good idea for the date. Maybe we should go get ice cream. We can't go get ice cream because I have a big surprise planned for you. Really? I was going to wait till after this movie, but I can tell you're scared. No, I'm scared! Yeah, yeah, just me that's scared, right? Yeah. You have to close your eyes. What? Where are we going? Right this way. Oh my god! Oh yeah, the surprise for her. I wonder what it's gonna be. It's gonna be good. I can't wait. Where are you taking me? Yeah, this is a big surprise. I'm so nervous. A little bit further. Can I open my eyes, please? Here we go. Oh, it's gonna be bad. Oh no. Three. Really? Two. Okay. One. We're here. It's the gym. Thought we can come here and do a little gymnastics, tumble. I can show you how to rock climb. Maybe like hand. What? Hand. I have to go. Rebecca. Well, that was a bad idea. Well, this is birth to death of a gymnast. The gym makes sense. <laughs> Rebecca, you okay? <laughs> What's the matter? I brought you to the gym. I thought this would bring back really good memories. This is the gym.
gym that I used to go to. You don't understand. I want to understand. Can you explain? <laughs> when I was younger, I had a competition and my mom was at a meeting and I made her come and she got in a car accident because of me. Because of me doing gymnastics. I'm the reason she died. The person gymnastics made me was selfish and if, if I didn't do gymnastics then my mom would still be here. You're not selfish, Rebecca. <laughs> that was an accident that happened and it's not your fault. It is my fault. You can't control things like that. <laughs> what you can control is you following your dreams. If your mom was looking down on you right now, what version of yourself would you want her to see? The one that gave up on herself or the one that would follow her dreams? You really love gymnastics. I don't know if I can ever do it again though. I can help you with that. You have to believe in yourself. Oh, he's convincing her to do gymnastics again. I can do this. I can I can face my fear. If my mom were here, that's what she would do. She'd be proud that you're saying this right now. But you know what? It's gonna take a lot of work. It's time to get to work. I can't believe I just agreed to do that. This is great! This is back awesome. on track! This is great! What, what do you mean? What happens if things go wrong? What if I can't handle it when I go in the gym? I mean, this is a lot to process. My mom did gymnastics and I haven't been in a gym since she died. Rebecca, you heard what he said. It's not your fault. It just feels like it's my fault. Rebecca, this is not real. It's the metaverse. I am sorry, you guys. In real life, I was a gymnast and I did have a friend and this happened to her mom in real life. This is harder than it seems. I don't know if I can do this. Well, I'm glad that you're dealing with this right now, Rebecca. You can do this, Rebecca. You can do it. You can do it. Okay, you got this. Okay, let me and Daniel. It's time to start training. This is my first time officially back in the gym working out since my mom's gone. She's watching me right now, so I, I have to be strong. I can do this. Dad? What are you doing here? I'm here for you. Go, Rebecca. You got this. Dad, what if I didn't decide to come back into the gym? Well, I would have been outside. Better luck next time. I'm always here to support you. Come on, Thanks, Rebecca. Dad. Time to start training. You got this. Go, Rebecca. I hope she can do this. She only has one month till the national championships. But she's kind of out of shape. No, she's really out of shape. I haven't done the splits in a long time, so please be gentle. There is no time to be gentle. Ah! Cartwheel. Handstand. You have a lot to work on and not a lot of time. National championships are coming up. Hurry, Rebecca, this rope isn't gonna climb itself. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. Try again. Nationals isn't gonna take someone who can't fit. Uh. Get back up. Uh. 19. Uh. 18. Uh. 17, faster. Uh. There you go, Rebecca. Come on, 20 more. Faster, Rebecca. We don't have all day. Let's go. Ninety-five, ninety-six, ninety-seven, ninety-eight, ninety-nine, one hundred. I don't know if I can do this. Nationals is in a month. This is what my mom wanted. This was my dream too. I can do this. At least I think I can. Keep your legs straight, chin up, point your toes. Strength, composure, balance, Rebecca. Don't fall. Straight your arms. Point the toes. Very nice. She's getting better, this is great. Do you think she'll win the national championships? We got this! She's got a chance now, she's got a chance! I'm getting it, I feel like I'm getting back finally. You know, your mom went into labor right on this beam right here. What? She did? And she loved this gym and all that she wanted was for you to be a gymnast just like her. That's all she wanted? That was her dream. Well, if that's what she wants, then I want that too. I'm ready. Now go get it. Great job! Oh my gosh. It's hard when you've been out of a sport to go back in, but I feel like I picked it up a little bit. You were looking great in there. You went from noob to pro to hacker, I think, just now. Do you guys think that I actually have a chance of winning the national championship? Yes. Definitely. That was my mom's dream, but that might be my dream too. Just keep listening to that cute coach. Okay. I'm gonna go Maybe back that, in. Okay, okay. Yeah. Here we go! National championship! not in a boxing match. Competition day. Gotta get my hair right. Ooh, what is going on in here? Dad, you know it's a competition. Gymnasts can never have enough hairspray. Their hair can't fall out. Ooh, this fumes are gonna make me pass out. Anyways, I just wanted to say I am so proud of you. This is the furthest you've come in gymnastics and your mom would be so proud of you today. 
I don't know if I can do this. I, I don't know if I can win nationals. It's a lot. I know it's a lot, but I believe in you. And there's someone else here that believes in you too. What? Hey! Whoa, whoa! Hairspray, it's a, it's a gymnastics thing. There's a lot of it in here. I just want to come over and wish you good luck. You can do this. Thank You're a you. gymnast now. You're gonna win. Thank you. I mean, I'm I'm nervous, really nervous, but since you are here, I kind of wanted to just say, say thank you. I mean, if it weren't for you, I wouldn't be doing this right now, and I wouldn't be back in gymnastics. As mad as I was when you brought me on that date to the gym, it was honestly the best thing that ever could have happened. Well, I actually want to come over here a little early today before the competition to say thank you. I'm actually a parkour level two Whoa. person now. Yeah, I'm not just a climber anymore. They let me do it in public. Congratulations. Thank you, thank you. Okay, I don't know what parkour is, but parkour. You're gonna be late for your competition, so let's go. I got this, just one sec. I'll be right there. I just need to breathe. I can do this. Mom, please help me. I've got this. Super cute pep talk, Dad. And guys. You still need to win the national championship. There's gonna be a lot of competition. Rebecca, if you nail this floor routine, then you will be the national champion. <sighs> I'm so nervous. I hope I can do this. Not just for me, but for my mom. Well, whatever happens out there, I want you to know that I'm proud of you, and your mom would be too. Now, come on. Thanks, Coach Katie. It's down to last and final event. This is exactly how it was when her mom died. Why did she have to pull floor last? Hey, come on, Rebecca, you can do it. You know, I never got to thank you for getting her back into this. This is her mom's dream for her and hers too. You know, she got herself back in. I just had to help her realize that. And plus, she also made me get a handstand, so that was kind of cool. Yeah, she's good at that. This is it. You can do this. Just breathe. Come on, Rebecca. She's got this. Keep going, keep on going, keep on going. Speaking of metaverse, you're not done yet. What? The game needs you to go it. back in. This is birth to death, Rebecca. Oh no. Who's gonna die? She's gotta go back in. Daniel! I need to figure out how this ends. Here we go. Are you kidding me? She's gotta die. Mom, are you comfortable? Yes, honey. And thank you for finding me my nationals leotard. It's so special to me. But it's time for me to say goodbye. I'm not ready for this. And Guy, you've been an amazing guy. You believed in me when I didn't believe in myself. So thank you. I'll always be your guy. And daughter. Yes, Mom? I know how much you love gymnastics, but whatever you decide to do, just remember to never give up and to follow your dreams. Mom, I love gymnastics because of you, and I'm so proud that I get to call my mom a national champion. I love you. I love you, honey. Your mom and dad would be so proud of you right now. Who's most proud of both of you guys is this guy. I love you, guy, and I love you. Mom! 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 I'm not ready to say goodbye! <laughs> oh. Please come back! Oh my god. I'm sorry! <laughs>
Birth to deaths are so hard and so emotional. Zanfam, comment below if you have ever experienced a death and how you got through it. This gymnast lost her mom, but she never gave up and ended up following her dreams. And look what it got her, a gold medal. You guys want to find out what happened to that coach? With the dad? Okay, no, no, you know what? I think it's time we do a happy program. What about that one right there? Okay. 